Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And remember, remember, the 5th of November, Guy Fawkes night it is, and hopefully we'll get plenty of explosive action on the pitch to match the day. It's Brentford versus Everton. Well, thanks, Derek. Never mind the fireworks going on outside the ground. I'm expecting fireworks on the pitch. It should be a spark of the game, though. Looking forward to this one. Chowdhury. And in with a real chance. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So Everton get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Anthony. Opportunity it is. Well, he gave us a go with power, but he might be having second thoughts about that now. Well, as you said, he's gone for power, but he's not even close in the end. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, he's been in fine form in the league, as you can see from those stats, and it's going to be a real test. Oh, surely! And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So, 2-0 now. Valencia. And he's won the ball. Oh, what an opportunity! The net is steering him in the face. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Now, sending it in. Oh, can you believe what we've just seen? I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Well, as you can see, the hosts have really dictated oh, the play. Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Deli Alley. Everton unable to hang on to the ball. And threading it forward. Fantastic reflex action. Tom Davis. And well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. Opportunity. 
Well, the keeper had a lot to do. Well, it's a great piece of goalkeeping. So quick off his line. Oh, in with a chance. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. And over comes the corner. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Draxler. And there it is. The half-time whistle is sounded. No doubt about it, the home fans will be the happier of the two, Stuart. Well, before the game, we talked about their defensive record. But it's the forwards who have been still in the limelight today. They've been so sharp, plenty of movement, and if the first half is anything to go by, I can see there being more goals in the second half. And now they get the ball rolling. And back underway, no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response from Everton in the second? Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Tom Davis. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Well, here it is again, and just look at this. It's such good technique. It's a wonderful strike from that range. Well, it's an out and out pasting. 6 0. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Brentford taking on Liverpool. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game, that. Hopefully, I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they take advantage of the situation? Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will, and while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. Moving forward effectively, but they dealt with the threat posed. Difficulties for the goalkeeper. Deli Alley. McNeil. Oh, well hit, but couldn't keep it down. They will now make use of the substitutes bench.
a quarter of an hour remaining here and with that the attack fizzles out Ener Valencia careless in possession oh great attacking play now shot happy here not the easiest of situations for the keeper they decided that now is the time to go to the bench Who can they pick out? Well, it has come to nothing. Could be troublesome. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, not the best clearance. Oh, well, that putting too fine a point on it, he's missed it. Idrissa Gay. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Kenneth Taylor. Well timed tackle. Able to skip past his man. The referee blows for full time. It ends in a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, they've been great defensively, as we know, but it was all about their front players today. Their movement, awareness of space, and speed of thought was just too much for their opponents. They could have won this by a lot more.